it's Diamond Heart, and I'm going to be doing another interview type thingamajigger. And obviously, there's going to be a special guest because I'm not going to be asking myself a whole bunch of questions. So, we're going to be interviewing Bobo Sweet. Where is she, you ask? She's in this phone. So, Bubble Sweet, how do you feel about being in a phone? So are you actually stuck in the phone or are you just in it? So how long are you going to be stuck in this phone? No, actually. Yeah, it's really painful. Oh, okay, then I don't want to try that. <laughs> so, you're stuck in a phone. Yeah, I know, weird, right? I went to the doctor. I actually tried to go to the doctor, but they, um, the sign said no cell phones. But you're not trapped in a cell phone, you're trapped in a home phone. Exactly. Well, it said no phones in general, but like, you know, phone, same thing, you know. You know, this is a really awkward conversation. I know. <laughs> okay. So, yeah, all right. Have you ever gotten run over by a car? No, actually. Yes, I am aware of how weird of a question that is. You do realize that's not safe, right? Being stuck in a phone? No, getting run over by a car. Oh yeah, I know that. Seriously, Diamond Heart, what kind of question is that? This is Diamond Rose, by the way. Oh, hi Diamond Rose. Should have recognized your safeness. Yes. Do you know what happens when you don't follow rules? No, you fall out of a tree. <laughs> oh. Um, you sure about that, Diamond Rose? I mean, I know that when you don't follow rules, you could get hurt, but fall out of a bleh, fall out of a tree, really? Yes, really. It's totally possible. So, anyways, back to conversation, um, random question asking. Yeah. Okay, just don't ask any more ridiculous questions. Who, who are you on the phone exactly? Okay. Oh, it's Bubble Sweet. Oh, hi, Bubble Sweet. Hi. Uh oh, I just remembered something. What did you remember? I left Flitterheart unattended. Okay. The whole world's gonna explode! I gotta go. Sorry, bye.
Yep, that's definitely a safety hazard. So, has a building ever fallen down on you, Bubble Sweet? Uh, well, you see, I fell out of, out of the building once. I said, don't ask any more ridiculous questions. That is a ridiculous and dangerous question. Bottom day, she was just trying to have a little fun. Well, it's not fun, it's dangerous. Seriously? Fun? It's... That's it. I'm leaving. Goodbye. I don't want to be a part of a dangerous conversation. What was that? Bubble Sweet, who are you talking to? Um, hey, you were talking to yourself. Okay, that's kind of strange, but okay. <laughs> so, yeah. So, this video has only been going for six minutes, but we have been talking, Bubble Sweet, for an hour. So, I'm pretty sure now would be a good time to say goodbye. Okay, well, bye, Bubble Sweet. Bye. I'll see you tomorrow, okay? Yeah. Bye. Bye. So that was my talk. Well, interview type thing with Bubble Sweet. It was kind of awkward through a phone but if you want me to do that more often then I guess I could do that so yeah but unless you're EG Sparkle aka Bubble Sweet um, don't ask me to do it with you because the only reason why I did it with her is because, well, because I already knew her phone number and stuff and I call her all the time. So no, if you're going to ask, I'm not going to do that with you. So yeah, I will see you in my next video and if you want to find out what diamond rose meant by not following rules could get you falling out of a tree watch my next video because you're about to find out bye everybody